welcome back to the vlog welcome back to my channel it's vlogmas day 21 and yes i did notice in yesterday's video i noticed it while i was editing that i said the wrong day it was actually day 20 so yeah i was trying to make sure i got it right today it's day 21 and like i stated yesterday today we're going to be eating all red food all day so only red food for 24 hours so um I think I also already said that you know I tried to do this in like a more like healthy kind of way like where it was actually like meals and stuff because usually when I see these videos it's like a bunch of like color like junk food or whatever so I thought it would be cool to do Christmas colors that's why we did green yesterday and red today but I wanted to keep it like healthy and actual like meals or whatever so yeah that's what we're gonna do today so if you haven't already or if you're new here please go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos I know vlogmas is coming to an end but I don't want you to miss any of my other uploads I really want you guys to stick around and you know just enjoy my content so yeah we're about to go ahead and get right into making our first meal okay so the first thing that i'm gonna try to make for them is red pancakes so i said yesterday um if i couldn't find the food coloring that i was gonna try to like make the pancakes red myself by using like strawberries so that's what i'm doing like i have the strawberries right there like heating up and cooking so i'm gonna like cook them down a little bit to get that red color and then i'm gonna put them in the pancake mix to hopefully get a red pancake. So that's what I'm about to do now. I'm gonna go ahead and mix the mix and everything. And then once I do that, I'll be back. Okay, so this is the pancake mix I'm using right now. It's just like a Walmart complete pancake and waffle mix. And you're supposed to only add water. Um, I never got this one before, so I don't know how good that's gonna taste, but we're gonna try it. And I'm only gonna make about maybe like, let me see, two, four, six maybe seven or eight pancakes because that's probably all we'll eat so it says to do that that i need one cup of pancake mix and two-thirds cup of water so yeah that's what i'm about to do now okay so Okay, I think that's one cup. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm mixing it. And I think I'm gonna keep the pancake mix inside of here because it'll be easier like for me to pour and stuff. So I'm gonna keep it in here, even when I add the red and put it in the pan, cause it'll be much easier for me to like make the pancakes in this glass measuring cup. But now my batter, maybe if I hold it in the light, see it's like red now, or at least pink. It has like a red tint. So that part worked. So now we're about to go ahead and make the cupcakes. And I also, maybe I should have added more strawberries, but yeah. And I also have some syrup back here because I love warm syrup with my pancakes. Who else likes warm syrup? So when I'm done with the pancakes, I'm going to heat that up a little bit and put it on the top and have the boys taste Let's it go ahead and get started with the pancakes so of course you guys already know i had to use the red plates like yesterday i had everything on the green plates so today i put everything on the red plates so this is how the pancakes turned out like you can't really see them that good but they do if you look right here they do they are red um of course when i cook them you know they got like a little bit brown and then i put some strawberries right there the boy the boys said they don't want any syrup but we'll see after they taste them if they decide they want syrup on them so yeah i'm about to call them in here so they can go ahead and eat this okay so what's the verdict show the inside so we can see that they're red see they're actually red guys so what's the verdict i definitely taste strawberries <laughs> how do they taste to you good i guess well, what do they taste like? Are they good, bad, what? They taste like, like normal pancakes. Oh, they taste like normal pancakes? You can't taste the strawberry? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so that was meal one, guys. Red pancakes. 
They said they taste like normal pancakes. All I did was add strawberries in them to make them red. So I will see you guys when it's time for meal two. Okay guys, so I'm back. I decided to try the pancakes for myself since we didn't get very much commentary from the boys, but I'm just gonna try them just to see like how they taste and stuff. So, and I opted to put, um, why do my glasses look like that? I opted to put a little bit of syrup on mine. They didn't want it on theirs, but I want some on mine because I love sweets. So I'm going to try it now. It's good to me. Oh yeah, it tastes good. Especially with the syrup. But I can taste the strawberries, but that part is good. But yeah, guys, I think I told y'all in one of my videos, I don't even know, probably a while ago, that I'm not really a cooker. Like, I don't really cook that good. So I just wanted to do this because I thought it would be like a cute little idea and kind of like do a Christmas theme, you know, the green and the red, but I'm not a cooker. I don't cook that well. I don't even cook that often. Um, so when you see me like make little meals, like on this video and maybe like in future videos, like keep that in mind. I don't claim to be a chef or even know how to cook really that well. Y'all saw how my pancakes look like some people can make those perfect little circle pancakes and stuff. I can't do nothing like that. I'm not a cooker. <laughs> I came up, as a matter of fact, like I came up with a term for myself and other moms like me like years ago, a couple years ago. And I was like, um, I think I put it, I don't know where I said it. I don't know on some social media, but I was like that I'm a cook free mom or either like a cook light mom. So basically that means like if we could avoid cooking, we don't like, you know, we get like stuff that's usually already prepared or something that's simple, like super simple to prepare, which for me, it's, well, I ain't gonna say it's like hard cause I don't have a microwave. Cause I think I told y'all that too. Like I don't believe in the microwave. I don't like microwaves. I don't own a microwave. Like when I heat up food, I do it like in the oven or on the stove or whatever. But yes, yeah, so I'm like a cook free mom or a cook light mom. <laughs> like that means I'll pick up some food real quick or like I said get like super simple like meal kits or something like that so yep I know how to do the basics like of course I know how to make little basic stuff to where my kids are fed and they're full and stuff like that but like I don't know I'm not that great at it so in case you're wondering or if you're gonna wonder in the future like dang why her stuff look like that that's why i admit it but it doesn't even bother me i'm not even the type that's like all like gung-ho about cooking some people love cooking that's okay like some people love like doing different recipes and love doing i'm not into cooking like that i'm not like i'll go like i said i'll go pick up a meal real quick so yeah so the little simple stuff that I'm going to make today, I'm just letting y'all know in case it don't look that great. That's why. So anyway, yeah, their next meal will be some pasta with shrimp and like red sauce. We're going to make it red because of the sauce and the shrimp and all of that. So the next meal will be red and it'll be pasta. So whenever I am fixing that, I will be back. Okay, y'all, so it's time for their second meal. This one was pretty simple, so I pretty much already cooked it. All I had to do was boil the ravioli and then just warm up the pasta sauce that I got and put the shrimp. Well, no, I cooked the shrimp first a little bit, then poured the pasta sauce in there and warmed it up. So, yeah, their second meal is ravioli, and it's red because of the red sauce. So, yeah, I'm about to go ahead in a few minutes and put that on their plates, and then you guys could see that. And we'll see how they like it. Hanson picked this out when we was in Walmart yesterday. So hopefully he likes this one. He wasn't really that fond of the pancakes. And y'all already know Hayden was just like, oh, they just taste like regular pancakes. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go in the kitchen and um, put that on their plate. And then when they try it, I will be back. <laughs>
Okay, so the boys are trying their second meal. Did you get a good chew and a good bite yet? <laughs> it's really hot. Oh. But does it taste pretty good? It's really good. And yeah, this is the one Hanson picked out. So it's still red. The pasta is red because it has the sauce on there. Y'all don't come for me in the comments. It's still red. <laughs> How does it taste to you? Good. That's good. Okay. He said it was good. All right, so that was meal two, guys. So we'll be back for meal three. And that's going to be steak and red beans and rice. And I think I got a pretty easy red beans and rice. So it should be easy to cook. Steak, I don't eat steak. And I mean, I used to eat it. I feel like I used to know how to cook it. I don't know. I haven't cooked it in forever. So we'll just see, you know, how it turns out. I mean, I know you're not supposed to cook it until it's like tough and all of that. So, so yeah, we'll see how that one turns out. What's up guys? I wanted to come back on and end the video and also just update you with what happened. So I ended up not cooking meal three because the boys were saying that they were still full and everything from earlier. And they also had had a snack and all of that in between. And then they ended up saying they just would rather finish up the ravioli than me cook a whole nother meal. They get like that sometimes where they get full super quick. Um, they don't get that for me. <laughs> I don't think sometimes I get full quick, but not really. But I think they get that from their dad. Cause I remember like he doesn't eat a lot at all. Like he, <laughs> I remember like when we were together and stuff, like he hardly ever ate. Like I used to never see him eat pretty much like never. But anyway, <laughs> so yeah, I think they get that from him. Except for my oldest son, he does eat a lot sometimes, but other times he gets full really quick. So I don't know. But anyway, so yeah, they were too full for me to cook that because it was going to be like steak and rice and stuff. So I just told them I'll cook it for them another day this week. But yeah, everything we ate today still was red. It still was a whole red day. It just wasn't as much food. And the snacks were like red Doritos and like red apples, stuff like that. So yeah, we did still eat only red food. <laughs> so yeah, I just want to let you guys know. Also, before you leave, if you haven't already, please be sure to hit that subscribe button, like this video, comment, and you know, let me know if you liked it. It was just, like I said, um, just a cute little idea. I thought it would be cute, but... <laughs> I don't know. You guys let me know and I will see you in the next one. Bye.